schools across England could be affected by walkouts in the autumn term if coordinated strike action by teachers and head teachers goes ahead. Four education unions representing most school leaders and teachers have said they will join up for any future industrial action in this long-running pay dispute. And don't forget the teachers are on strike today. Yeah, uh, Kevin Courtney, the Joint General Secretary of the NEU, added that up to 400,000 teachers could be involved in the autumn walkouts, which is a huge number. We're going to go now to Anna Riley to get the latest. Good morning. Good morning, Anna. I'm in Leeds City Centre. Good morning. Hope you're both doing well. I'm in Leeds City Centre at the moment, ahead of a rally that's taking place here. And it's going to be coordinated action with teachers, as well as members of the RCN, so that nursing union as well, joining together, giving speeches about why they're on strike today and what demands they want to make from the government. It's obviously about pay. Teachers and nurses are saying that they want a pay rise in line with inflation, but teachers are also saying it's about the conditions. They say that they're going through a retention and recruitment crisis in education at the moment. Now, I was on a picket line earlier at Lawnswood School, which was actually visited by uh, Gareth Southgate last week and he praised the work of the teachers and the pupils there. And this is what one of the English teachers, Dan Hearn, had to say. Recruitment and retention is the main one. Uh, keeping staff is really, really difficult with when every year uh, the class sizes get bigger but resources get smaller and existing budgets just strain and strain and strain against that. Look, cost of living has impacted on me. I mean, I'm, I'm struggling to afford to strike, but I'm doing so because I think it's important to safeguard the future of these teachers. Public support does seem to be good. We had Gareth Southgate in the school the other week and he was supporting the strikes as well. So, yeah, uh, parents on the, on the whole seem to be really supportive as, as well. After this picket, I'm actually going in school to teach my Year 11 class to make sure that the, my exam classes don't suffer as a result of this and so are a lot of other people here. So we don't really want to cause disruption to students. The thing is, disruption is already being caused to students by things like retention, by things like lack of resources. So if anything, this strike is to avoid further disruption. And ultimately, uh, you can't say that you value education and then not value teachers. So that was the view from one teacher on a picket line there in Leeds this morning, obviously reflecting on the, the crisis in, in education was what the teachers were saying on that picket line today. And we'll be providing more reports today as this rally begins in Leeds City Centre.